welcome to our channel. My name is Faith. Today we're going to be talking about my top favorite five glute exercises. I love working out and I'm very into fitness. So I thought I would come to you today just to show you ladies some glute exercises that actually work or have worked for me. You will see a huge change within a few months. As always, you know, a proper diet and nutrition is very important to follow in order to see true results. If you're eating badly and then doing these exercises, you may not get the results you want. So I highly suggest um, investing in a proper meal plan or nutrition guide. We will have more videos to come on different type of exercises for the glutes, for the legs, for the quads, for the hamstrings, for every part of the, of the body. The first exercise of my five favorite glute exercises is of course the cable pull throughs. I know you've probably seen these all over Instagram and it's for good reason. These work if you're doing it correctly. I like to stand with my feet a little past shoulder width apart and literally just contract my glutes and squeeze as hard as I can when I come all the way to the top. In this exercise, I like to up my weight a little bit. Um, it's up to you, it depends on how many reps you do, of course, and I can get into that later on. But this exercise, if you continuously do it and you make it a part of your routine, you will see results. The next one, cable kickbacks or cable donkey kicks. Um, either way, I really like these. When I first started doing this exercise, um, I couldn't get the form just right, but I found the perfect way. I bend all the way over, basically my back straight, and just kick back. I use lightweight here because I can feel the contraction more when I'm my leg is all the way straight out. The next exercise will be the hip ups. These exercises aren't in any particular order. However, I will say the hip ups will make your groups grow the most out of all of them in my opinion, because it's literally all glute work, not hamstring. Well, they can be, but mostly glute work. When you push that bar up, you are literally pushing it up with your glutes and squeezing as tight as you can when you get to the top. Your back needs to be straight as a board. Your neck needs to be in alignment with your back. And you literally just push the weight up. You can start light if you're a beginner. Um, however, I think these are one of the exercises that you should go heavier on just to try out. The next exercise is going to be the deadlift. There are many variations of the deadlift. I'm just doing a basic um, Romanian deadlift here. You just stand with your feet shoulder width apart and you hinge at the hip when you're going down. Once again, your back should be straight as a board. Your neck should be in alignment. Your chest should be up. Your core should be in. And when you're coming back up, you need to contract your glutes and literally force your hips back up with your glutes and squeeze as tight as you can until you feel like you're going to pop that's the best way you're going to feel the deadlift and i like the deadlift because it also hits a lot of your hamstrings i love hamstring work because it co-signs with the glutes um these are this is one of the best exercises for your hamstrings and your glutes The last and final exercise will be good mornings. Good mornings is my personal favorite glute exercise because it's so easy to do. And if you do it correctly, you will most definitely feel it in your hamstrings and your glutes and you will be sore the next morning. You don't even need a heavy weight for this. All you have to do is stand shoulder width apart, hinge at the hips. When you coming back in, you squeeze your glutes as tight as possible you don't like i said you don't need a heavy weight and it's just so easy to do you can just pick up a barbell and hinge at the waist straight back flat neck chest up when you're coming up and you're good to go
Hope you guys enjoyed the video and come back soon. Remember to hit that subscribe button, turn on the notifications because we are just getting started and we have so much more for you. Bye.